Hi, so I'm going to talk a little bit about what I feel like our school is doing well in regards to the deep dive of important skills that are in project-based and problem-based learning. So our school does a good job of kind of incorporating that project-based learning into specific things. So every Wednesday at our school, we have invest or a specific day that's called Science City. So each teacher in the grade level is creating a project that the students are going to do, often a STEM or STEAM project, and they are having to, you know, students are having to create things or make things, um, do an experiment, and using those communication skills, their iPads, um, you know, working on op being open-minded and working through problems. So they're doing those things. And this is an elementary school, so these are more basic, at least in my experiences with the, uh, the first graders. Um, but, you know, we do those types of things, and they have a design process that they have to go through. And then on top of that, every year we have something called Outside the Box Day. So we just had Outside the Box Day. And in our Outside the Box Day, the students have a problem or project-based learning, and they have to use this design document, and they think about what they're going to create. So ours this year was based off of a little boy who made um, his own carnival games at his dad's shop. And there's a great video, if you've never seen it, that explains how he did it. And it gave those kids that connection to this little boy. And then they had to create their own carnival games using recyclables as well. And they had to go through that design process. So we gave them all the materials and told them, you know, what they could use. They had to draw their design, create it, and make sure it had those criteria that they were supposed to have, redesign, and then they got to videotape them themselves in my classroom in Seesaw explaining how their, their activity worked or their carnival game worked, and so they did that design process in that sense. Um, they also have something called Investigation Station at our school um, where every month, three times a, a month, the students in the class get to go to very special um, Investigation Station lessons, which are almost always some kind of project-based lesson or outside, you know, problem-based or something like they had to help plant things in our courtyard and, you know, those types of things. Um, so they do a great job with that as well. Um, and then the last thing I thought of was in our math workshop times in class every day, they have choice menus and they have to think about how to create their time management, even as first graders, like what activity are they going to do? How are they going to get it completed? making sure they get all their activities finished and giving them some kind of um, idea of like their project and their pace and how they're gonna complete those things. So those are just some of the things that our school's doing. We don't have like a official like project-based learning and I think there could be a lot more incorporated and I think they're trying to do a little bit more of that, but we are doing it in lots of different ways and don't really realize it, um, I think mostly. Uh, hopefully. And a lot of the teachers probably are or some of them aren't and we're trying to, you know, promote that. All right. Have a great one. Thanks.